I'm Makita Kimmett, the artistic director of Egun Omude Performing Arts Collective, the playwright of the Caltel Switch, or the adapter of the Caltel Switch. It's already a story that was kind of morphed into what it is now. And I play the Anisha Egun in the play, The Caltel Switch. I'm Baye Kimmett. In this play, The Caltel Switch, I play Shango. Shango is a Yoruba king. He's uh, also a, an Orisha, which is a spiritual energy that rests in the Orun, uh, Oba Orun, which is the heavens. I am Felusho Mimi. I am the musical director for the Cowtel Switch, providing the score for the play. My name is Alfred Jupp, and I'm a musician for the Cowtel Switch. Queen Noor, and I am the storyteller, or the narrator, in the cow tail switch. My name is Omomala Iyabumi, and I am the shakeaway player in the cow tail switch. Hi, my name is Ayana Abdul Rahim, and I'm one of the musicians in the cow tail switch. I also assist with the set design. Hi, I'm Steve Slaughter II. I'm a musician in the cow tail switch. That the cow tail switch uh, is a traditional African story. In any storyteller, any black storyteller, uh, let's say the National Association of Black Storytellers, or African storyteller here in America, if you name one of the top three stories you have to know, it's the cowtail switch. But this cowtail switch, <laughs> the way that Makita Kimmett rewrote it, is much different. The you get a little, little bit of the meaning at, at, at the end of the same in terms of who gets the cowtail switch. And, and the message that as long as we call out the names of those who go before us, then um, we keep them alive. But the whole front and middle of the story teaches uh, a Yoruba tradition that's different. It has other elements of lessons that are, that are, very, that are very different. It's miraculous, actually. The cowtail switch uh, to me was a lesson that you should uh, be obedient to the divine guidance. The cowtail switch, uh, the lesson I got from the play was to be mindful of others um, and not to be self, not being selfish. There's many, many different lessons that you can find in our production, the cowtail switch. But one that sticks out the most to me is the reward the reward that you get from being humble and being patient. Not looking for the reward, but just being humble, staying on the right path, and naturally, our rewards, the gift from the Creator, it happens naturally. I think the message that I got from it um, was the unity that the village, you know, the people in the village uh, shared with each other. Um, with one common you know, situation, they all you know, came together um, to you know, uh, have a good outcome. You know, they, they all, you know, stayed together and they all were humble as well. They all learned the lesson together and it was a good outcome in the end. Well, the Caltel switch, um, the main lesson for me that is streamlined throughout the all three productions is this notion of choice and consequence. That your choices determine your destiny. That you hold the choice but you do not hold the consequence. Um, well, there's tons of blessings you can get from you know, the cowtail switch, but if I was to sum up everything that I've gotten from this play, it would just be selflessness. And that's it, selflessness. What I want to actually say is a, a lesson about community and about production. As far as I know, the cowtail switch, the journey, the Five Pumpkin Seeds, there are no other productions like it in the United States. It's an African musical theater full of lessons, values, morals, culture, tradition. What I've learned from the Cartel Switch is that <laughs> all of the wishes of the heavens must be carried out. All, all of, of them. them. We have such a beautiful cast of musicians and actors and storytellers here on the stage. So, we have my wonderful wife here, Makita Kemi, yes. She plays the Onishegun, 
Onishegun is the owner of Medasan. Yes. And she has a degree in theater arts from Rutgers University. So that means she went to school to learn this right here. Aha. This brother here to my left, this brother has a degree in music from William Patterson. Aha. So that means that he studied how to put together performing arts productions. Oh, this gives our group, Egun Omade, such an advantage to have not just a guy who learned the Jinbei from his friends. Oh, no. This guy here is going to the proper channels to learn what he knows. And I, the Oba, Shangod. No, 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 you missed it up. Okay. The Oba, Shangod the King. Aha. Yes, that would be me. I have a master's degree in education. Yes, so somebody stopped approval on me and said, you can go out and teach the world. And that makes the counter switch much different than your play, Ashe. <laughs> the counter switch! My name is Akosua. I am Feishara. I'm the one who gets the counter switch. My name is Corey. I play as Olukemi in the counter switch. And I am the leader of the secrets. The